Shelter teams are working to triage the more than 200 animals they rescued from a house on this block. They're also counting the dead in a case that has shaken even veteran shelter staff. Teams from the Seattle Animal Shelter rescued one animal after another Thursday from a pair of homes along 26th Avenue Southwest. This is one of the most significant severe cases of animal cruelty that I have seen in my career. Shelter director Ann Graves says they found dozens of dead animals on the property. She says they're still assessing how many perished and what caused their deaths. She says the city found more than 200 live animals, including dogs, rabbits, guinea pigs, and chinchillas. Teams rushed those animals to the shelter, where it's an all-hands-on-deck situation, with veterinarians and staff working into the night trying to save lives. This all started with a tip. The shelter worked with Seattle police to search the property with a warrant. They arrested a suspect, who now faces charges of felony animal cruelty. Somebody saw something concerning here and called us and reported it. We came out and saw enough to uh, start investigating and that culminated in this. So we appreciate any time someone sees something concerning that they report it to us so we can investigate. This really speaks to the importance of speaking up if you see something wrong. Yes, it does. Absolutely. Animal cruelty carries a possible punishment of up to five years in prison, a $10,000 fine or both. We're trying to learn more about how people can help those rescued animals. Right now, the shelter staff says their priority is just getting them through the night. In West Seattle, Ted Land, King 5 News.